This video shows the use of Chess OCR, an Android app, to recognize chess figures in books and magazines. This app is an update in the renamed version of Chess Fig RDR Lite, which has been removed from Google Play. You can use this OCR technology to quickly analyze individual positions or to look up games containing that position. Here I place a figure from the book 60 Memorable Games by Fisher in front of the camera, and then I start the app. This figure is the one shown in the icon of the app. I center on the figure, then I press the screen to start the recognition process. The recognized figure is drawn on the screen after, after which we must select who is to move, and only then can we proceed to recognize more figures. Each recognized figure is appended to a PGN file, and the RAS recognized figure is saved in the clipboard as a fence spin. The next example is from an informative book of combinations. Again, I put the figure in front of the camera and touch the screen to start the recognition process, but this time I hold down black to move. This is equivalent to choosing black to move and then selecting the analyze option. This invokes the chess program Droidfish directly, which takes the figure passed on the fence string and makes it the current figure. We see that the program has found the correct move to solve the tactical problem, which is QE1. Now I press the back button to return to the OCR app. Next, I change a parameter so that the recognition is done twice. This setting is suitable for recognizing more difficult figures in older books. Here I have the Pan Book of Chess, which uses an older font for figures. Again, I touch the screen to start the recognition process. This time you can see by the repeated autofocus that the recognition is indeed done twice, which produces a more reliable result. I select white to move, and again hold down to invoke Droidfish on the recognized figure. The program finds the correct move in the position, which is BH7. For my last example, I will show how to do a database lookup to find all the games that contain a given position, which makes it easy to replay and analyze games from magazines and books. Again, I use a position in the middle part of the same game by Fisher, but as annotated in a magazine. The Droidfish program has been previously associated with fence strings for figures, which means Droidfish is automatically invoked when I press hold black to move after recognition. Here we can see Droidfish analyzing the recognized position. Now I will change this relationship so that Droidfish is no longer implicitly invoked. First, I go to settings apps, and then clear the defaults associated with Droidfish to remove this association between Droidfish and a fence string. Now when I start Chess OCR and select Analyze, it will give me the option of choosing the program used to analyze the last recognized figure. My next example, I choose SCID in the Go to do this, which is an implementation on Android of SCID, a free chess database program. SCID in the Go starts with a given position, and now I search for an exact match in the current active database, which returns all the games containing that position. On a moderate speed Android tablet, we can search this 2 million games database in approximately 5 seconds. It's not always easy to find all the PGN files from in a variety of books, so I've created a free database of 2 million games, which is on the app website, and made it the current active database. The search result is a set of games containing that position, and when I select the game by Fisher, the position for which I search is displayed, along with all the moves in the game. Chess OCR is the demo version of this program, which can only transfer 25 positions, but it always displays the recognition results correctly. If you purchase Chess OCR Pro Key from Google Play and install it on your device, all the restrictions are removed. But please remember that you must also keep the original Chess OCR app installed. The website kgrothapps.com has more info. Thank you very much.